I mean, come on. Like, you are paid to play a game. I understand the risk of injury. I understand that if you get hurt in the 17th game of the season, that you could risk future earnings. I miss a playoff game. Go out there and do your job. Just do your job. Okay, play so, the game. Okay, so Have some fun playing the game of football. Right, what, what's too many? So, look, 17's cool. Let's, let's, let's add another one for in five years. Make it 18. Uh, again, I have no problem with 18 games. You'd play 162 if you could. If I could, I would. Um, and, and I understand that that my perspective is different. I And, you know, I, I know some people make fun of the fact that I still think I can go out and play. I still want to go out and play. I don't care how much it hurts. It is so much fun to play the game of football. Go out there, do your job, have fun doing it. You're getting paid a lot of money. And stop whining about it. Our telephone number is 248-539-9797. Uh, that is also the ticket text. I, boy... I can't imagine you standing up in front of a room and say, it's like a union meeting and, you know, coming up with that speech. People throw stuff at you. Uh, yeah, until they <laughs> until they look and they see, okay, well, in, in another two years, let's look and see what that salary cap is going to be. Let's see how many more hundreds of thousands, oh, oh wait a second, could be millions of dollars we're going to make as individuals because we're going to play one more game. And if I'm telling way, my we only have my three preseason games. If, and if, if we go to 18, we're only going to have two. You know who this hurts? This is going to hurt the guys that are undrafted who don't have four preseason games to be able to make the team to show that they and have all that thousands. And all that, all that money that you're talking about, these guys aren't going to be able to spend because their brains are so fried from you know all that extra contact. Oh, oh, uh, oh, boy. Oh, oh, that's too bad. Listen to John. He doesn't care about concussed athletes. He doesn't I, care. I, I was one of them. I know. You obviously I, don't care. Do I, and, and if I if I could go back right now and play and beat my head against the wall, I absolutely would because it was fun. Coming up next on the Stony and the Anders are all show uh, headers here. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh! Oh, there's a pilot. Who's made the older reference today, Stony, or uh, with the colonies, or uh, John and his uh, caring about concussions? Team? <laughs> Either help us. Yes, so there's this pilot that is in some, some pretty big trouble after he was actually caught on a hot mic before he took off, and uh, now the FAA uh, is investigating. All right. The hot mics are getting a lot of people in trouble. Uh -huh. I just said to take it. And how appropriate that I would be talking about this, uh, Reed, right now when I just talked about that extra game. If you're dealing with old sports injuries, arthritis, <laughs> joint pain, <laughs> if you've been told you need a new hip or knee, pay attention because I need to tell you about Straight Orthopedics. Dr. Grant, Dr. Fleischman at Straight Orthopedics are Michigan's top hip and knee robotic joint replacement surgeons. Why use a robot? The surgeon can plan your entire procedure in advance. The incisions are more precise. It's less invasive, less chance of human error, less tissue, muscle, and ligaments removed. Therefore, you have a quicker recovery, like walking almost right after hip replacement. And it gets even better. It's their hospital for orthopedic procedures. So you're not there with a whole bunch of sick patients. You're not trying to walk around a hospital, trying to find an orthopedic wing, trying to find your doctor's office. And if you've got to spend the night, Nine out of ten patients, it's outpatient. There is no room sharing. You get your own private five-star suite. If you're like me, you don't want to deal with calling and making an appointment, waiting a month to see a doctor. With Straith, you can get a same-day appointment or call and mention my name, John Jansen, and get a free joint replacement and orthopedic telehealth assessment to create your own plan. So if you're in pain, don't wait another day. Give Straith Orthopedics a call at 855-STRAITH. That's 855-S-T-R-A-I-T-H or online at straight.org. Straight Orthopedics is committed to you. 97.1 The Tickets. Traffic. From the WWJ AM 950 Traffic Center. In Roseville, there is still a closure because of an earlier accident. Southbound Gratiot Avenue closed between Utica and Martin Roads. You'll find some heavier traffic on I-75 northbound approaching 8 Mile, as well as additional road work today leaving one lane open, 75 northbound between 13 Mile and Maple. I'm Michelle Pena with traffic. The Detroit Tigers host the Cleveland Indians. Free game Thursday at 1250. 97-1, the ticket. Hey, there's always one team that ruins your bracket. That's why this year, you gotta love the FanDuel Sportsbook app, America's number one sportsbook, because on FanDuel, your first bet is risk-free. Doesn't matter if you bet on Michigan or Michigan State. New users get up to $1,000 in site credit back if your first bet doesn't go the way you plan. FanDuel has odds on all the action with games day and night. An easy-to-use app, multiple deposits, and fast withdrawals always on promotions. And your next chance to win is minutes away. And if that's not enough, FanDuel wants to make you a millionaire. They're giving away a million dollars to 
unlucky bet or new and existing users get an additional shot at that payout every day you bet the tourney. So, if you want your shot at becoming a millionaire, download the FanDuel Sportsbook app and use the promo code Doug so they know I sent you. That's FanDuel Sportsbook. Promo code Doug. Must be 21 or older and present in Michigan. No purchase necessary. Restrictions apply for million dollar drawing. Risk free offer for first online real money wager only. Site credit is not withdrawable and expires in 14 days. Restrictions apply. See full terms at sportsbook.fanduel.com. Gambling problem call 1 800 270 717 for confidence. <laughs> FanDuel, official sponsor of 97 1 the ticket. 21 at least 10,500 miles a year. No security deposit. Easy plan pricing. Escape customers in trade in 1995 or newer non Ford vehicle. Includes Ford Select Inventory rebate and Ford matching down payment rebates. F 150 for returning lessees. Total due signing. Escape 2279. F 150. 3430 plus tax, title, license, and 115 doc with approved financing through Ford Credit Ends 331 2021. It's the matching down payment sales event at Pat Millican Ford. Brian Godfrey, your customers always look forward to this event. What can they expect this year? Customers can get a $500 down payment match on Ford's most popular models, making now a great time to upgrade. Lease a new 2020 Escape SE all wheel drive from only $159 a month, or experience the newly redesigned 2021 F 150 XLT Super Crew 4x4, starting from only $299 a month. And now, upgrading to a new Ford is faster and easier than ever. You can choose your vehicle, apply for financing, and value your trade online with Millican Express. Start your experience online at patmillicanford.com or visit the dealership on Telegraph Road. Pat Millican Ford, the experience you deserve. Hey everyone, it's CJ McCullum, host of the Pull Up Podcast. Part of performing your best is feeling your best. Whether it's during a workout, running errands, or just hanging around at home, nobody wants to deal with body odor. That's why there's Dove Men Plus Care Eucalyptus and Birch deodorants to combat sweat and keep you feeling fresh and confident throughout the day. It has 48-hour protection and a plant-based moisturizer that cares for your skin. Try Dove Men Plus Care Eucalyptus and Birch deodorant. Odor protection that works. Experience the Dove Men Plus Care plant-based line for yourself. Buy it now at Walmart and Target. If you're a man facing divorce or custody issues, you need the attorneys at Adam. Expertly protecting men's rights for over 25 years. Call 248-356-ADAM. 248 248- 356 Adam 248 356 ADAM Most people know that Mr. Clean Magic Eraser removes crayon and scuff marks from walls, but did you know it even cleans tough kitchen and bathroom messes that are sometimes tough to tackle? Just wet, squeeze, and erase gray soap scum on your bathtub. Erase cloudy hard water spots in your shower. Erase burnt on stovetop messes. So for all your tough kitchen and bathroom messes, try Mr. Clean Magic Eraser. Mr. Clean, Mr. Clean, Mr. Clean. Hey everybody, it's Boomer Science and connoisseur of case management or guru of global sales. Whoever you're looking to hire, you can find them at Indeed. Sponsor a job post and Indeed's instant match searches millions of resumes in their database and immediately delivers a list of quality candidates whose resume fits your job description. You can even add an Indeed skills test so candidates can show you their skills that go beyond the resume. No wonder Indeed delivers four times more hires than all other job sites combined. According to Talent Nest, visit Indeed.com slash credit. Detroit's hometown sportsbook. Bet Rivers is the official sports betting partner of the Detroit Pistons. All season long, make your basketball bet with a trusted team at Bed River Sportsbook. Get started today with a special offer. Use the code 250MATCH to get up to $250 in bonus money on your first deposit. Don't miss out on this great offer. Use code 250MATCH today. Bet with a winner. Visit BedRivers.com and get in on the action with Bed River Sportsbook. Must be 21. Playable in Michigan only. Gambling problem? Call 1-800-270-7117. The Tigers home opener is only three days away on 97.1. The ticket. Live from the Jamie Samuelson Studio, here's Tony and Chanson. All right, Michigan will be in the Elite Eight. The Florida State 76-58. They'll take on UCLA, who defeated Alabama in overtime 88-78. Late last night, uh, the other Los Angeles, the University of Spoiled Children, as they like to call it, uh, over Oregon 82-68. USC will take on Gonzaga. We defeated Creighton 83 65 tonight. We got two games uh, to get to the Final Four Oregon State and Houston, and then the late game Arkansas and Baylor. And the Wings, by the way, in a real nice weekend, defeating uh, Columbus 4 1 yesterday at the Little Caesars Arena. Here's Heather with news. All right, you guys, listen to this. Two teenage girls are actually facing felony murder charges after they carjacked and crashed an Uber Eats vehicle, killing the driver in the process. This is horrendous. The incident was actually captured on video. And that 
video is now circulating online, and these girls, they're aged 13 and 15, all right? So they targeted this Washington, D.C. car. They allegedly tased the driver and then made their move to steal the vehicle. They were able to get inside the car, stepped on the gas while the driver was actually hanging out the front door of the vehicle. The car crashed and flipped over, killing the driver. Absolutely horrendous. The driver's family has set up a GoFundMe page and it raised over $500,000 in just three days. A lot of money. Yeah. It is a lot of money. Uh, just 13? Yeah. 15? You're going to carjack a vehicle and take, you have a taser? What's that? What is happening? I mean, 13, I feel like I was a baby still, yeah. you know? Yeah. Golly, it's awful. Yeah, yes, yes, yes you are. Um, after 11 seasons, Sharon Osbourne is parting ways with the talk. Now this comes after her heated on air discussion about racism and her defense of Pierce Morgan. We talked all about this. This argument between her and her co-host, Cheryl Underwood, sparked this big network investigation into other accusations that Osbourne made multiple racist remarks over the years to some of her previous co-hosts. So on Friday, the network says that Osborne had decided to leave the show, so she quit, and they said that her behavior did not align with their values for a respectful workplace. So at this point, no replacement has been announced, but the show will return on April 12th. Yeah, you know what, I've, I've watched it a couple of times. Uh, I, don't even, I don't even care about her. She's a weirdo anyway. She was the only, so far, the original host from when the show right. started that has made it this far. So now, I mean, I don't really care either. Yeah. I've never, I mean, I've seen the show. I know the show. I know what it is. I but it's not something I sit down and watch. It's <laughs> not on my radar. <laughs> it's not on my radar. I feel like more women watch it. Yes. Well, yes. Is how I feel, yes. Uh, this is a great story. So that pup who was rescued from the Detroit River after he spent 14 oh, yeah. little days out in the cold, well, he's found a new home with a man saved his life. This is really cool. So if you go back and think of February, this little dog who has actually been named Miracle uh, was chased by a coyote, was stranded in the middle of the icy Detroit River for four days, all right? And people couldn't believe that this dog actually survived and it was rescued from Mud Island and the person who rescued the dog is now going to be the dog's permanent owner, um, which is pretty cool. So the dog's going to Canada and uh, will live with Jude and his family. Hey, it's what a dog. Story. I'm glad the dog's good. Meant to be. I know. Glad he survived and now glad that the person who rescued him gets to care for him for the rest of his life. What a happy ending for sure. Uh, the Michigan women's basketball team made it back to Ann Arbor safe and sound after the plane actually was forced to make an emergency landing in Indiana on Saturday after their loss to Baylor. So the plane lost pressure. I guess it was traveling through a storm. The oxygen masks dropped. It sounds like they needed to be used, and the turbulence was just awful. Thankfully, nobody was injured during all of that, and the team did make it back to Ann Arbor early Sunday morning. But it sounds like the most terrifying flight experience ever. Like, I would have been terrified. I, like, the slightest turbulence, I am, like, white neck like the, the whatever. That's why it's good to be asleep on a plane. Gosh, I can't sleep well on planes, and I just, I, I don't know why, I'm just, I'm not comfortable, I'm a little nervous, I guess, but, yeah, I hate flying. They scared the crap out of me, that's for sure. Um, the FAA is investigating a Southwest Airlines pilot who was recorded making this uh, cuss-filled rant all about Northern California liberals just before takeoff, okay? So basically, this pilot is caught on a hot mic. And the entire 
talking about subjects that are unrelated to safely conducting their flight while taxiing or while flying below 10,000 feet. So this pilot uh, was in some trouble. Southwest says that they are um, handling the matter internally.
personal bank, handling all my financial needs, my checking, my savings, even my mortgage. They took the time to get to know me and my situation, educated me throughout the mortgage process, and were responsive with all my questions. Level One Bank offers competitive mortgage rates and a wide array of mortgage products. You can even schedule a free, no obligation consultation to see how much home you can afford or how much you can save if you refinance. It couldn't be any simpler. And Level One Bank is a local community bank, Michigan-based for Michigan families, with loan officers that live and bank locally, too. You can trust the, the mortgage experts at Level One Bank. Go to levelonebank.com forward slash John Jansen Mortgage. That's levelonebank.com forward slash John Jansen Mortgage. Level One Bank is a member of the FDIC and an equal housing lender. This hour's ticket signing bonus keyword is magical. Text magical to 72881 for your chance at $1,000. Pull up to churches today for boneless that's bringing it all. Bringing buttermilk marinated juiciness and all white meat deliciousness. Try our new Texas tenders or chicken sandwich with new smoky honey cube sauce for just $3.99. Churches bringing that down on Sunday. Off the ballot at participating location. Jimmy 
Jackson and Sharon Howard were in the same building when the Elite Eight came. So Michigan beat Ohio State and Jimmy Jackson to get to the Final Four. Ha ha! You like that? Also, uh, last night late, you uh, didn't stay up. Uh, USC over Oregon, 82-68. USC will take on Gonzaga in the opening game of that uh, doubleheader tomorrow night. Uh, the first tickets to be punched to the Final Four will be tonight. Uh, Oregon State takes on Houston, followed by Arkansas and Baylor. All right, uh, Friday afternoon, we got word of uh, a couple of trades that uh, completely altered the uh, the draft boards of many teams uh, heading into the NFL draft, which is a now a month from Thursday. Uh, the Miami Dolphins, who had the third pick of the draft, they traded that pick to the San Francisco 49ers for their first-round pick, which was number 12, a third-round pick, and a first-rounder in 22 and 23. Sound familiar, doesn't it? Uh -huh. Pretty much identical to what the uh, Lions got from Matthew Stafford. Meanwhile, Miami, they weren't just happy with that 12th pick that they got. They moved up and traded one of the first-round picks that they got from San Francisco uh, to Philadelphia, where the Eagles' first-round pick, which is number six, which is right before, obviously, the Lions. So, how does this affect the Lions? Does this help the Lions, hurt the Lions, not affect them at all? 248-539-9797. I think in a weird little way, weird way it hurts the Lions because I think it's pretty much obvious now that the quarterbacks are going to be one, two, three, four possibly. Now Atlanta is still a mystery because they still have Matt Ryan and whether they'll, whatever they're going to do, maybe if they even keep the pick. I mean, Carolina supposedly, like they were all in Deshaun Watson, but that's not happening right now. So maybe Carolina wants to move up for the fourth. Uh, who knows after that? But I, I think the Lions, if they thought about a team trading up to seven for a quarterback, I don't think that helps them that much. And conversely, if the Lions for some reason want a quarterback, uh, this might take them out of the uh, equation unless they want to trade up, which I do not recommend at all. Well, I think after everybody saw Trey Lance at Pro Day um, and they saw the, just the raw ability I think that he was going to be gone before that number seven pick anyway. So this, in my opinion, doesn't necessarily affect the quarterback um, draft. It just affects the value that the Lions can get in return. And will they be able to find a trade partner to trade down into the second, you know, in, later in the first round? Because if if you if we go under the premise that Trevor Lawrence, Zach Wilson, Trey Lance, and then Justin, Justin Fields are gone, they're off the board by that number seven pick. I don't know that Mac Jones is the type of talent that somebody wants to trade up for. I don't necessarily know that there is a wide receiver that you would go up the draft board to get. I don't know, and, and I, I would 100% think, I know we talked about Michael Parsons and his you know, pro day last week, and how good it was, I still don't think that there's anybody that wants to go up the draft no. board to get him. I think chances are the Lions are going to have to stay where they are. Yeah. Unless, and this is just an unless, there's a team, maybe New England, that really likes Mac Jones and is worried that maybe Carolina would take them after the Lions. That's the only thing I can think of. And may, or maybe there's a team that we don't, we're not even thinking about. Uh, because, yeah, you're, you're right. And but what it does do, though, is if we believe, and look, things can change in a month. Uh, telephone number 248-539-9797. Uh, the fact is, if those four quarterbacks are going to go one, two, three, four, so the Lions at seven, so you're sitting there, all right, four quarterbacks are off the board, one, two, three, four, so I'm at seven. So I'm going to have my choice, or at least I'm going to get, chances are, one of either, you know, Sewell, Pitts, or Chase. Right. So if you're the Lions, I think you say, cool, I'm going to get one of those three. Now, unless they have somebody else targeted there, they'll, get, they'll be able to get them too, whether it's a, or some, we know a little bit, John, you would know better than me because you play the position that it's Slater because of his positional versatility is actually better fit with them than Sewell, but uh, I'll, I'll leave that to you. Whoa. But the Lions sitting at seven, they're going to get a really good football player, at least on paper. Well, uh, yeah, uh, Yes. And so what this does is it just limits the options. It doesn't mean that they don't have a good option. 
It just means they don't have as many options. Rashawn Slater, uh, the offensive lineman from Northwestern, yes, I do think that he may be a better fit for the Lions because of his versatility. And, and you think about, okay, well, you know, the Lions already have a left tackle. That left side of the offensive line is looking really good. So, you know, Penny Sewell, can he make the, the, the change to being a right tackle for at least the start of his NFL career? He, I think he could. He's that good of an athlete. But Rashawn Slater has proven that he could. You could trade down and get Rashawn Slater. But who, again, who wants to trade up to that number seven pick? And it's, you know, Pitts, Chase. Yes, you're going to get a really high-quality pick at number seven. Unless where I'm sitting there saying, wow, the Lions are cool with one of those three, you know, uh, you know, Pitts, Chase, or Sewell at seven. Another team is sitting there saying, wow. We can get one of those three at seven. I might trade up. I might give up a second round pick or even a third round pick if it's only a couple of spots. Yeah, it's it's gonna it's all gonna be about what they can get in return. And that value has gone down in in regards to what you can get for drafting a quarterback at that number seven spot, or as opposed to drafting a uh, a Kyle Pitts or a you know Penny Sewell. Or, you know, all of those things they just they they go down. Right? That's the value is just not there like it was. But if you stay pat, like you mentioned, you do. You're going to have your pick of four guys. Penny Sewell, uh, Kyle Pitts, uh, you know, Chase, the wide receiver from LSU. Uh, or, you know, if, if you wanted to take, if you just had your mindset on a defensive player, Micah Parsons will be there. Or if you want an offensive player, or another offensive lineman, there's Slater. Or if you want another, right. or for some reason... I don't see why you would want Waddle or Smith ahead of uh, Jamar Chase. You have that option as well. Right. And so, I mean, you, you're going to get a very high quality, you know, contributor at that position. You just, your options for trading down have been a little bit limited. What's the best case scenario for them? If somebody does not take a quarterback in the top four or even before they get, they get there, and maybe they sit there, hmm. Hypothetically, it's Fields or Lance. You know, I really like him. Uh, I don't need him. I, I need him to sit for a year, so I'll take the seventh pick and take Fields or Lance. Or even, to a certain extent, Jones. But I don't, I don't think you do that. I don't think so either. And, I mean, the wild card is going to be, what do the Jets do? We all believe that they're going to take Zach Wilson. Mm -hmm. But they have Sam Darnold. Man, you see that throw at his pro day? Woohoo! <laughs> Yes, on air. Everybody looks good on air. Um, but I, th I do think Zach Wilson goes to the Jets. But they, if they don't take him, and if Atlanta doesn't take a quarterback, maybe if, if the Jets don't, then Atlanta all of a sudden they become a, you know, a, a team in the quarterback market. Um, and so it, there's, there is some variable at the top of the draft. I just don't see the Jets passing on Zach Wilson. I don't see San Francisco passing on a quarterback. Atlanta, it all depends on what they believe they have in Matt Ryan or what type of, you know, what they believe is coming out in the draft next year and what type of season that they'll have because they're going to have a new quarterback. They may, they may not be picking at number four next right. year. This might be their chance to get one of the top four quarterbacks. Well, let me ask you this. There's a, there's a player involved in all this who might be, I don't know, you can look at him as a loser in all this or possibly a winner if he gets dealt to another team. And I'll tell you who that player is coming up next. 97 won the team. Hey, if you want to have the best lawn on your street, you want to look out your window and see a beautiful, lush, green lawn, well, the company that can make that possible is Natural Way Lawn and Tree Service. If you want to beat the crabgrass, the grubs, the insects this year, all those things that tear away at your lawn, don't wait because it's easier to prevent those problems than it is to fix it. Natural Way Lawn and Tree Service is going to assign your lawn its own specialist and create a custom-tailored solution specifically for your yard and your home. They're going to tackle all these issues using fewer chemicals and environmentally sound practices, and they have been doing this for over three decades because they are locally owned and operated right here. You can reach them at 888-GET-GREEN and on the web at naturalwaylawn.com. It, it doesn't end because you've got to act now for a limited time only purchase a full lawn program and get free gut control and free surface insect control but you got to mention my name john jansen and the ticket that number again in case you missed it triple eight get green or at naturalwaylawn.com natural way lawn and tree service get green stay green with natural way 97 one the ticket traffic
from the WWJ AM950 Traffic Center. This report brought to you by Edible Arrangements. There's a closure this morning in St. Clair County, 94 eastbound after 26 Mile Road. All lanes are blocked due to a crash. You can use Gratiot Avenue as a possible alternate. Easter is right around the corner, and Edible Arrangements has sweet Easter treats. Enjoy an Easter bouquet or platter loaded with fresh strawberries and festive bunny-shaped pineapple dipped in rich semi-sweet chocolate. Pre-order today by calling any local Edible Arrangements store or visit edible.com. I'm Michelle Pena with traffic. The only way you can take 97.1 The Ticket with you is the Radio.com app. Download it today and listen to us anytime, anywhere. This Radio.com Sports Minute is brought to you by North Bloomfield Properties. I'm Amy Lawrence with the Radio.com Sports Minute. As defending Super Bowl champs with the ageless Tom Brady as their fearless leader, the Tampa Bay Buccaneers were already the team to beat in 2021. Now with Leonard Fournette signing over the weekend, they have all 22 starters back from last season's roster. That rarely happens. A lot of guys want to get paid after they win a ring. But considering how they peaked at the perfect time and finished with eight straight wins, including three in a row on the road in the playoffs, it's easy to see why the Bucs believe they can repeat. And then think about how many guys took less money or one-year deals to stay in Tampa. Brady restructures like he always does. Shaq Barrett takes a sizable hometown discount to a man they all say they can go for two. And putting money where their mouths are, they show they're invested even when it costs them personally. I'm Amy Lawrence. Hi, I'm Scott Tannen, founder of Bull & Branch, and I've got good news. Our Cyber Monday sale was so popular, we've decided to extend it for one more day. You can still save 25% on everything at BullAndBranch.com, including our award-winning sheets, the sheets three U.S. presidents sleep on. This is our biggest sale ever, and you don't want to miss it. Go to BullAndBranch.com right now for 25% off our sheets, our towels, our blankets, everything, plus free shipping. There's never been a... Guys, guys, we need to clear a path here. Indeed knows unexpected employee turnover can stall your business. John. Like at Chris's logistics company, to avoid things grinding to a halt, he needs to get started hiring right, right away. I need Indeed. Indeed you do. And the moment you sponsor a job on Indeed, you get a short list of quality candidates from our resume database. Visit Indeed.com slash credit and get a $75 credit for your first sponsored job post. Terms and conditions apply. Hey, it's Eli Erskine with the BetQL Tournament Timeout, brought to you by BetMGM, the king of sportsbooks. Tonight in the college basketball tournament, Baylor takes on Arkansas in one of the regional final matchups. Baylor is a seven-point favorite, and Arkansas is plus 240 on the money line. The total is around 149. Baylor knocked off Villanova in the regional semifinals to get here, forcing 16 turnovers while overcoming a seven-point deficit in the second half. Arkansas hung out at the buzzer against Oral Roberts in the same round, as Oral Roberts missed a three that would have sent Arkansas packing. Baylor's biggest advantage in this game will come from three-point land, with Arkansas struggling to defend the perimeter. You'd also expect Baylor's guards to have a better shooting performance than they did against Villanova, going 3 of 19 from 3 as a team. I lean towards laying the points with Baylor, but I'd much rather try to lie bet the favorites to get a better number. Even if Arkansas were to start out high, it won't be able to keep up with Baylor's ball pressure down the stretch. This BetQL tournament timeout is brought to you by BetMGM, the king of sportsbooks. Download the app and sign up today. Must be 21 years or older, Michigan only. Gambling problem? Call 1-800-270-7117 for confidential help. Excludes Michigan disassociated persons. Hi friends, Bill Gelling here at Golly Chrysler Dodge Jeep Ram, inviting you to stop in during Ram Truck Month going on all March long. For example, qualified Chrysler employees can lease a 2021 Ram 1500 Bighorn Crew Cab V6 4x4 for just $2.99 a month. Leases for 36 months, 10,000 miles a year with 1,000 down. Remember, we have more than 2,000 vehicles to choose from, so come see us. I think you'll really enjoy doing business with us here at Golly Chrysler Dodge Jeep Ram in Bluefield Hills, Chelsea, Roseville, and online at Golly.com. Did you know there's more than one Las Vegas? There's the Strip with families on vacation and questionable odds. Then there's downtown Vegas, the original gambling and entertainment mecca. That's where you'll find the D Las Vegas. Book your stay at the D.com. The D Las Vegas, your home for Detroit sports in Vegas. Parents, do you want to save your child's life? 97.1 The Ticket Student Heart Check can help. Make the time to have your child checked. Contact the Ernst Cardiovascular Center at Beaumont Hospital in Royal Oak. Learn more at 971theticket.com. You could win the ticket signing bonus. $1,000 11 times each weekday. Powered by BenQL. Let BenQL's proven data and analytics help you become a better, better. Download the BenQL app today. Listen for the keyword at half past each hour. 7 a.m. and 6 p.m. Text that keyword to 72881 before the end of that hour. Message and data resupply, and you could win a $1,000 signing bonus on 97.1. The ticket. Pointing out directions. 
76-58, taking on UCLA tomorrow. 9.57 tip on our brother station. WWJ. Talking about the NFL trades that took place on Friday. Miami trades their number three to San Francisco. And then Miami trades the, the pick they got from San Francisco. plus a first rounder they got from San Francisco to Philly for the sixth pick in the draft. So I think the winner of this, as far as a player, in a weird way, is Sam Darnold. Because, you know, you can say, well, I can say that. The Jets might get rid of him because they have Zach Wilson. Yeah, but, you know, when you re they get Zach Wilson,